time for The Real World with Lee Anderson, Westminster's toughest talking MP and not shy of tackling the country's most important issues. Today, Lee confronted Home Secretary Suella Braverman about the invasion of more than 40,000 illegal channel migrants reportedly now living in British hotels after the emptying of the Manston Processing Centre. So here's the King of the North in action. What do I say to the people in Ashfield who say to me, this is absolutely ridiculous, we've got hard-working taxpaying people in Ashfield, paying their rates, paying their taxes, helping to look after our own homeless people and put them in local hotels, now they've been turfed out, to put people in who, quite frankly, have been trafficked, they've got no right to be here, and some of them are criminals. Please tell me what I say to them. Well, I, I, I agree that we are in a, in a crisis, and um, you know, I don't think it's uh, fair to try and minimise the challenge that we are facing. Lee, were you satisfied with Suella's response? No, not at all, not at all. I'm not satisfied with the response. The response was expected. You know, I've been banging on about this now for 18 months to two years, the same question. At, at, at the start, I was on my own. A few colleagues have joined in now. We're making the same noises every single day. Look, it's an absolute scandal. I'm embarrassed. We've got people in Ashfield that's been turfed out of a, a hotel for homeless people, and we've got the illegals up in there. Like I said to Suella today, what do I say to my constituents? Other than I'm sorry, we've let you down and we should be ashamed of ourselves. Because Lee, these figures that have emerged today are astronomical. I mean, <coughs> we, the British taxpayer, in the middle of a cost of living crisis, yeah. we are paying for 40,000 migrants to stay in hotels. I mean, um, this cannot, this is not sustainable. It's a scandal, Dan. I mean, I can bang on all I want. I come on your show every week and bang on about it. I bang on uh, about it in the, in the chamber at work. I go and see the Home Secretary, I speak to colleagues, and still nothing changes. It's got worse. We've got the Borders Bill in. We've got the Rwanda plan coming. It's got worse and worse and worse. It's time for drastic action, and I keep saying it, and they think I'm some sort of lunatic over at that place. When they land on our shores, we should give them a cup of tea, a couple of sandwiches, and send them straight back to France the same day. Once we start doing that, they'll think twice about coming. But, Lee, why can your fellow MPs not understand that unless you do that, and do that now, mm. I can't see any way for well, because, party to win the next well, because, election? Well, I come on this show every week called The Real World. They don't live in the real world. They live in the Westminster bubble. I suspect once the uh, illegals start dropping on their doorstep, in their hotels, then they'll start and kick off about it, which we're seeing at the moment. Well, I've said it before, you know, some of these MPs have got second homes in London, let's turf them out, put some of these illegals in, and then they'll start making a noise about it in the chamber the day after.